morning, John F. Kennedy Elementary School. How you doing out there? Uh, today is Friday, March 27th, and we have successfully done five days of distance learning. It's been a growing for all of us. We're all learning and experiencing how best to try and navigate this new world for us. And when I'm thinking about that, one of the good things, I'm always looking at the positives in life. This has been really hard for us not being able to be around each other and support each other and see each other. But one thing I have been doing is it actually makes me slow down and really see the world better. So for example, all right, Miss Vecina brought this in my office for me. And I was like, wow, those are beautiful flowers. Where did you get them from? They're from our courtyard. And I was like, are you kidding me? These, have, these beautiful flowers have been in our courtyard. I've been here nine years. I've never noticed them or seen them. And they smell beautiful. So from now on, I am just trying my best to, you know, look at the positive of what's going on, enjoying people I am able to spend my time with, and the things that I'm seeing. Yeah, I'm really hearing the birds sing, I'm taking more walks, I'm exercising more. So I hope you're doing all those things too. We need to take care of ourselves during this time. And uh, speaking of taking care of ourselves in more ways than one, we have to make sure that we are building our leadership skills, right? Because leadership is so important. We have to be leaders and we have to help others as well because leaders do help others. So leadership is about taking responsibility for yourself, right? And not making excuses. And we've been really impressed with the amount of people that are starting to really get on a good cycle and come on and do the work they need to do and submit the work, take the feedback from teachers. So we need more and more people to continue doing that. Um, it is hard. This is hard work. And we're asking you to please use your teachers, use the adults, you know, that are helping you out at the school. We've got a lot of adults on Google Classroom, so you can post questions there. You can ask for help. Um, we're going to help you as much as we can. If you can, try not to bother your parents only because they have work to do as well. Okay? Um, today, the trivia, actually not today, yesterday's question was, where did the Olympic Games originate? And Ms. Wood asked that question. And the answer is, drum roll, Greece. Yes, it is Greece. And it was cool because I saw a lot of people posting that on Google Classroom. Many, many people had known it was Greece. So good job. This question that we want you to think about is, what food serves as the base for guacamole? Guacamole is a great food. And I don't know if a lot of you have it or not. You have usually have it with like some type of nachos. It's a good little dip. Um, so the, main ing the base means the main ingredient. So what is the main food that goes into making guacamole? I have a feeling a lot of people are going to know this one. All right. Um, and lastly, just let your uh, families know that there's going to be a survey that we're going to be sending out. And the purpose of the survey is to kind of evaluate our week of distance learning. Um, you know, we know we're hearing, you know, some people are loving what we're doing. Some people are struggling with it. Um, so we want to make sure that we can help everybody out. It might be too much work for some people and not enough for others, but we're just trying to get a gauge on how people are feeling. So if you could encourage them to take the survey, please, so that we can get some feedback and we can tweak because this is a work in progress, but we do want it to work for as many people as possible, okay? And remember, your learning works for your family, okay? It may not be that nine to one hour or whatever. Um, you may have to do it later on or earlier. Whatever works for your family to do the work is what works. You could do a little work in the morning, a little in the afternoon. It's not like we have to be on our devices all day, okay? So lastly, we're going to do the, the Kennedy Commitments. And remember, these commitments are for life. They're not just for JFK. It's going to help you be successful in what you do. So I'm going to say them. And what Ms. Wood and I were talking about is Mr. Mercier now puts them up on the screen. So instead of doing an echo chant, let's do them all together. So whoever's in your house too, have them come over. Let's all do it together as a chant. All right, here we go. Today, I will do my best to be my best. I will listen. I will follow directions. I will be honest. I will respect the rights of others. I will remember that my choices affect me and those around me. Today matters and my future is built one day at a time. I hope you all have a great day of learning and you have a wonderful weekend. Remember to keep on learning even if you're not doing it on your device, okay? There's lots of things to learn about the world. So be good, have a respectful and responsible and safe day out there. We miss you. Bye.